HVAC Climate Control Troubleshooter at a glance. The Climate Control Troubleshooter is a complete automotive air conditioning repair solution, fee software is vehicle make specific, so the program adapts to whichever vehicle you're working in. Start by clicking the HVAC Troubleshooter desktop icon. After starting the software, you'll see a big green continue button and the version number. Click it to enter and you'll see the pick new vehicle screen. HVAC systems tend to be of similar technology across different models. In fact, oftentimes, the exact same HVAC computer is used across the entire manufacturer line. The rest of the components tend to be the same, which is why we've structured the Hovok troubleshooter by manufacturer. After choosing the manufacturer, right away you can see the entire HVAC software main screen with its six sections, pressure analysis, system tests, wiring diagrams, accessing codes, charge specifications, interactive conversion tables, and the help section. We start with the pressure analysis section. The pressure analysis section is a unique interactive software analysis module based on a large amount of data, pressure-related algorithm. The section hides all its complexity on the background. All you need to do is work the high and low pressure gauges and then click Analyze. This section is built with an algorithm containing hundreds of possible pressure schemes virtually any possible condition you could ever find. Why this section? It's simple. Using pressures is often the only way to determine component failure, such as compressor and expansion valve. In many ways, pressure analysis can uncover issues that temperature analysis cannot. Next is the system test section. This section is both an operations manual and a test section for electrical and components tests. A great complement to your HVAC diagnostic. The next section is the HVAC wiring diagrams section. This is a vehicle specific section showing a simplified HVAC wiring diagram for both manual and computerized systems. The wiring diagram section covers import and domestic vehicles and it's arranged in manufacturer and year. This is a unique section giving you simplified diagrams which are easier to understand and follow. Next is a section of how to access HVAC computer codes. In most cases without a scan tool, the HVAC is one of those systems whereby a scan tool may not be needed. Oftentimes, all you need to know is how to access codes and what the code means. These codes are vehicle specific and system specific. Following is a section devoted to refrigerant charge specifications. Automotive HVAC systems need two charge specs. These are the oil and refrigerant specifications. In some cases, your HVAC machine may have the specs database built in, which may or may not be accurate. In most cases, you may have to perform a full refrigerant charge after evacuating and vacuuming the system using a refrigerant scale and your gauges. In this case, the HVAC troubleshooter is your best friend. Here, you'll find all you'll ever need to do a full refrigerant charge. Next is the HVAC troubleshooter conversion table section. This section is needed to convert metric into English measurement units, as most vehicles sold in the United States are specified in pounds. There is also a decimal to ounces conversion feature. In all cases, for example, the charge amount may be 4.5 pounds, which means 4.5 pounds, but not 4 pounds and 5 ounces. This is a mistake that a lot of techs make in the field, resulting in vehicle under or over charge. A charge of 4.5 pounds equals 4 pounds and 8 ounces. This section saves a lot of time and mistakes from being made. Finally, is a concise help sections dealing with many different tests like HVAC relay test, pressure sensor, air flap actuator, blower motor, HVAC computer and more. This is a nice section for those of you starting out or for instructors in class training. As you can see, the HVAC troubleshooter software is worth its small price many times over. It'll help you diagnose 95% of all automotive climate control systems. Hope you enjoy it.